A few moments later. The trail leads down there. I'm sure of it.
carefully. Let him down slowly now. He yet lives. Aye, and he's coming around. Ooh. Radagast, are you well? Oh, what a thoroughly unpleasant experience. I shall have more pity for flies in the future. Can you tell us what happened? Sinathra snatched me. Took me unawares, I'm afraid. I really didn't expect to encounter anything of her sort in this corner of the wood. No, not at all. You see, I came here to get away from trouble. Darkness is spreading across Mirkwood. A darker than usual darkness, I mean. And it's coming from Dolgodor in the south. Roscobel, my usual home, lies a little too close to Dolgodor for comfort. So I came here. I have several such retreats. You can never be too prepared, living in Mirkwood and all. But, do I know you? No, Radagast, but you do know me. Ah, young Bellarum, it's a pleasure to see you. So you are a part of this little party too? <laughs> it's quite a mixed bag, really. I don't see elves, dwarves, and men rubbing elbows often. Especially not in Mirkwood. <laughs> now add an eagle as well. This is turning out to be a rather extraordinary day, really. All things considered. I am just glad we came in time. My friends and I have a mission, and we came seeking your aid. We're looking for the dragon Urgost, who lives in the Grey Mountains. And we have no time for a lengthy search. We were told you might be able to help us find him. You wish to find a dragon? Oh dear, is that really wise? The spider's venom can be deadly. We should attend to you at once. No cause for concern. It happens I know a thing or two about venoms and poisons. Sinathra's poison could be deadly, but killing prey outright is not the way of such creatures. No, they much prefer to keep their meals alive for a time. <laughs> Just as a farmer might age a cheese to improve its flavor, really. She used only enough venom to keep me quiet. Our mission is urgent. Do you know where Urgos can be found? Well, he, he's a dragon. So I would say the Grey Mountains. I... Yes, that is as we have already said. But do you know where in the Grey Mountains? I haven't the foggiest notion, really. What? So we've just been chasing the wind? Ah, uh, now, not so fast. I may not know where Urgos dwells, but I just might be able to find out. But I would need my staff for that, and I, I seem to have mislaid it somewhere. We found your staff. Here it is. I knew you would have need of it once we found you. Ah, oh, excellent. Aren't you the clever one? <laughs> Crafty as a fox in your own fashion, too, I can tell. I'm grateful to you. Well then, let's see what we can find out, shall we? My friends might know a thing or two. Indeed. Very brave of you. Well done, my friend. And there you have it. Uh, perhaps you could explain further for those of us who do not speak the language of swallows. Oh, you don't? 
quite a pity, really. They're rather pleasant little fellows. Always something nice to say. Well, what did this one have to say? Quite a bit, actually. Here, let me show you. Have you considered my offer? You bargain with what you do not possess, man of the self. I will have your price soon enough. Think carefully before you spurn this offer, dragon. As mighty as you are, you would do well not to offend my master. I did not say I refused. Only that you must first achieve my reward before you can give it. Ah, formality. I go now to take your price, but I will leave men behind to await your answer. Consider well, but not too long. My time and my thoughts are my own to spend. For now. Sinathra is no more. That was a feat worthy of heroes of the Elder Days. I am honored to have witnessed it. What of your friend Galron? Did you find him? Sadly, I was unable to save Galron. I discovered he fell in the same battle in which I was captured. I recovered his war gear from the Orcs, and I wish you to have it. Galron would be pleased to know it was still being used to fight the enemy. I must hasten home to inform my lord of everything that I've learned here. I shall pause only long enough to consult with Radagast. Farewell, Aradan. prove easier than dealing with it. Have you ever faced a dragon before? No. That is a risk I have gladly avoided. One does not willingly seek out a dragon unless there is no choice. You are afraid of dragons? Only a fool would not fear a dragon. If Urgost has survived this long, he must be full of the guile and cunning of his kind, abominations that they are. And this will make him even more dangerous. But that changes nothing. If we must prevent his alliance with Agandara, then fear must be set aside and the dragon dealt with. You are right, Belloran. We cannot falter now. We will go on. You have but to say the word and we will press on. 